Congratulations. Any questions over whether we'd have tired legs after winning on Tuesday night were answered early. A goal after three minutes, a goal after eight minutes. You had the boys coming out really fired up and ready for business. Oh, uh, I said to them they've got to start well. You know, I'm not a believer in tiredness. Obviously, yes, with the games, two and four days, and it wasn't off our own fault because uh, the current Yardam Shield game is meant to be after the cold rain they moved it for TV, but you, it does fall in the back of your mind. But I said to them, you, you've, you've got to be mentally tough, you've got to be strong physically, and uh, keep a strong mind. And uh, I thought there was some outstanding performances tonight. Four goals with 20 minutes to go. How important was it to keep that clean sheet? You said we needed the love defending, and um, we did that today. I said it. You know what? It's both both boxes. Look, obviously, we were ruthless today in the box, and we could have had more. Which was a disappointing set at half time, but the clean sheets are massive. From the goalkeeper, the back five, I thought they were outstanding. Um, and as I say, that's what they've got. You've you've two kids in there. You have a makeshift defence at the minute, um, and I say I thought they were absolutely outstanding tonight. Plus the midfielders, I, I couldn't fault anyone. I thought they were everyone showed intensity. Everyone was hungry, and I'm pleased for everyone. We got the the result, but I won't get carried away. It'd be unfair after what you've just said to single any of them out, but now and again, absolutely sensational tonight. I'm sure you'd love to be in the middle for some of his deliveries. No. He's had a great career, but he showed the passion and hunger still there. That's the nail again that everyone wants. Um, he's got 75 caps for his country for a reason, and he showed it. You need games like this, you need quality, and, and now certainly showed the quality. And a lot of injuries, obviously, at the minute. Cliftonville next, but we'll have a break now, eight days rather than two in a week. What's the, the situation? No, it's going to be a very tough game. You know, Jim's a great fellow, he's got a great team, I think, with the team this season so far. Um, but you know that our boys will, will, will have a weekend together, and all for team spirit, and uh, won't get carried away tonight, and then uh, we'll, we'll be hard at it on Monday.